Hello everyone and welcome back. In today's video, I'm going to be sharing out my high-waisted jeans slash pants collection. And this is a evolving collection of jeans. And I love high-waisted jeans. I think this is going to be my all-time favorite style of jeans. Um, and I don't think I'm gonna go back to either mid or low waist. I just really love the style of high-waisted and especially if it's like wide leg or kind of like a straight leg but a little bit wider where there's more room um, on the thighs. And you'll see some of that and a variety of the different types of high-waisted jeans that I have. And I'll probably go through my collection because I realized when I was filming this video, some of the styles no longer suits me and some of them are actually a little big on the waist for me. So needing to like size down to have a better fit. Um, so I think I'm probably going to get rid of some of them. Um, for example, the um, Everlane pants that I have, I keep forgetting the style of it, but um, I'm probably going to um to sell that at a like a reseller like a buffalo or something like that um i realized after trying it on i don't really like the high-waisted and kind of like a tapered tapered leg and i gravitate towards more of like a high-waisted straight leg or wide leg um, and I think even between the straight leg and wide leg, I like the kind of, I, I like the wider leg version, like the uh, Lisa Says Ga pants uh, or jeans, um, the other Everlane um, way high um, jeans and like Rachel Comey and the Jess Cam lookalike pants that I have. And you'll see that in the video. So without further ado, let's just roll in the video. Okay, let's start with this first jeans that I put on. No, no, I don't wanna play. Go, 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 go. I'm filming. Okay, sorry about that. Um, so the first jeans, um, that I'm showing you is the Levi's rib cage. And this has a super high waist. <laughs> no, we're not gonna play. Not right now. Go, go, go. All right, let's try this again. This is by far one of my favorites in my collection. It's super high waisted. Um, it's a straight leg. So um, I really like that style as well. And um, in the medium, I think this is like a, like a medium blue wash. Um, it doesn't have any rips or anything like that. And I, I like my jeans um, just like that. Um, it is a size, uh, waist is 30, although I think I could go for a 29 because when I do wear this, a few times without washing it it starts to kind of loosen up because it is pretty um like a stretchy material um it's great for you know food baby and uh, when you're actually sitting down it doesn't really like cut you um so there's um there's a give to these pants and yeah it's one of my favorite in my collection okay next i have another Levi's. Um, this one is a vintage find from Etsy. Um, it is the 512 and again it's um, super high-waisted. I believe 512. I think this might be like a style in the either 80s or 90s. Um, again it's straight leg. I did have to cut the bottoms because it was too long um, but yeah this is one of my favorite um, jeans in my collection actually there probably are all my favorite um, and this is in a, a you know a regular like blue denim wash 
I do like to, I do love like blue and dark wash. So you'll probably see a lot of that in my collection. And again, this is Levi's 512. Okay, next here is the Everlane um, 90s straight leg jeans in a blue color. Um, another yet high, it's pretty high waisted. It sits right um, around my belly button. Um, I do like this as well. Um, it is a little bit more tapered on the leg, um, which is a different style, but I do like it as well. Um, this is, I believe, in size 30. <laughs> yes, okay, so we're gonna go play. I believe this is like in size 30 or 29, I think. I'm, I think it might have been a size 30, but I, um, I lost a little bit of weight, so I could go for, I mean, if, it's perfect right now. I like it because it's not too tight. So when I sit down, it doesn't really cut cut through my stomach. And this is very rigid type of jeans. It doesn't have any um, stretch in them, but it is the type of denim where it's it's light. So that once you keep wearing it a few times, um, it does loosen up. So. This is the Everlane 90s um, straight leg jeans. Yes, Cora, I know. Next one in my collection, these are, or this is the Weekday Voyage um, straight leg in another medium, I would call this kind of like a medium wash. Um, I went for a, I think this is probably a 26 as far as the length because I wanted it to be shorter. And this is super high waisted. It sits right on my waist. Um, I do love the fit. Um, and it feels nice. Um, the jeans are, again, no stretch. It is pretty rigid it is a lot thicker um as far as like the weight of this uh, denim material it is a lot uh, more uh, thicker than the everlane one so this is the weekday voyage okay next up we have another weekday um Pants and this one is again in Vo the style Voyage, but this time around it's a button up instead of a zipper. Um, and I got this in a darker wash. And it fits really nice. And also I got it in a longer length. And again, this is the weekday voyage in a dark wash. Okay. Okay, next up, this is new to my collection. This is the Abercrombie and Fitch uh, 90s high waisted, like straight leg. Um, jeans in black. Um, again, the weight of this is it's pretty, I'd say a medium weight. It's not too thin, not too thick. Sorry. Um, and this also doesn't have a stretch in them. It is pretty rigid. Um, but over time, when you wear it a few times, it will loosen up just like any other type of like denim material. Um, and I got these in size 
29 extra short. I am, um, forgot to say, I'm 5'4", and my sizing for pants are either 30, 29, 28, so it's kind of like between that, just depending on the brand, and um, size 10 as well. Um, so yeah, this is the Abercrombie & Fitch, uh, 90s like high-waisted jeans. Okay, next up, um, I, as you could tell, I still have a tag on these. I just got this in the mail and I'm still debating if I'm going to keep it or not. But these are the, another Abercrombie Fitch. Um, these are the Curve Love Dad High Rise jeans. I got it in size 28 short. Um, this is, you know, as I'm not sure if you've heard, but the Abercrombie & Fitch um, jeans went viral on TikTok. So I thought I'd give it a try. And um, this style in particular, I'm still kind of debating if I like it or not. Um, it is really comfortable. Again, it's, it's high-waisted. It sits right on my waist. It is a little bit looser in the hip and thigh area for those ladies with, you know, voluptuous and nice curves. Um, I do have bigger thighs. However, um, my hip is, I'd say it's pretty normal, but um, my butt is not very big. So I don't really have anything to like really fill up the butt area. Um, but I do love the style because it feels kind of just relaxed and it's not too tight around this area. So I'm still debating. I think I will keep it though. I'm leaning more towards keeping it. I did try just a regular, um, not the Curve Love, but I noticed that um, it's not as high-waisted as this one. That one just kind of sits below my belly button. So, um, I wasn't really sure if I, I like that style, but yeah. Okay, the next one we have here is actually, oh, I forgot where this is from. These are ASOS uh, denim. I got it in size 30, but um, this is another one of my favorite style is a high-waisted with wide leg jeans um this is in the length 32 and waist is 30. um it kind of reminds me of the jazz cam pants um it's kind of like in that same same style and i really love it um i like that it's like wide leg it's very comfortable um the jeans actually doesn't have stretch in them. It's very rigid. Uh, it has like this tiny pocket here. And so, yeah, this is ASOS in the AKA Jess Camp Pants. Up next, we have this Lisa Says Ga pants. Um, again, this is another, I think one of um, in my collection of like high-waisted is really, really high-waisted. It's like, um, I don't know if it's probably the same as my rib cage one, but, um, yeah, I love the style of this. It's a little bit, it's straight leg, but a little bit more, um, room, a little bit more wider, uh, than kind of like, I guess, compared to the Levi's and uh, the other straight legs that I have, it gives kind of have like a wider straight leg, if you know what I, if you could, if you know what I mean, and if you could see it. But I love the style of this, I love the color, I'm so glad I picked it up. Um, and then at the back, it's just plain black. And I got this in a size 30. Um, so yeah, it's, it's one of my favorite 
you know, kind of uh, style because I actually don't have really pants with um, designs in them. So yeah, this is definitely a um, staple in my collection. Next up in my collection, another wide leg pants um, and high waisted as well. I think Okay, so I think this might be the highest rise in my collection these are rachel comey super wide leg i love it um and it has pockets as well um i got this at buffalo exchange for i think like 30 dollars so this was definitely a great find and i'm so happy i got them Next up are these Everlane way high jeans in a light wash color. Um, again, I am loving the style of like a wider leg, but it's still straight um, because I do have a bigger thighs. Um, I love that there's um, room to like move them around. <laughs> Um, so yeah, super high waisted again. Um, I love the cut of these. I, I don't have anything bad to say. Um, yeah, definitely a great add to my collection. Okay, next up is this vintage, um, 1940s sailor pants. Um, it has the name of the sailor, uh, sailor here too, but basically these are the same style as, uh, Jess camp pants that are like, I don't know, $300. Um, Jess Cam did get this exactly the same cut style with the pockets and everything from, from this, um, from these pants and um i got this at a vintage store for like 30 dollars it is a little bit loose on the the waist right here but i could probably tighten this up but again it's super high-waisted it's a little bit more kind of like a wide leg here it these are man's pants um man's sailor pants so um but it fits really well. I love it. It doesn't have a like a seam here on the side. Um, okay, of course. Off, off. I know, I know. Off, off. I know. Off, off. Okay. All right. Okay. Um, and it only has like pockets on the front here, and this is the back. Um, and I love it. Uh, it's definitely kind of like more of a summer pants for me because it's white and it's um, material is I believe this is like cotton and it's definitely um, lighter material so yeah these are vintage 1940s sailor pants All right, these are in a similar style, um, but I made these, I sewed this up. Uh, these are actually the Anna Allen Persephone pants, but they are um, similar design and cut as the 1940s sailor pants they're all from the same idea but um so i made this before i i found those in the thrift store or the vintage store because i really really wanted to get the jess cam pants and they're exactly the same style um but i didn't want to spend that much 
money on on uh, jazz cam pants and so i decided to get the um anna allen pattern for persephone pants and i made one myself uh this is actually the first sewing project i've ever done and i think it it turned out really well um it is a little bit shorter uh, because I wanted it that way, but um, you can definitely, you know, make it longer if that's your thing. But again, this is like kind of like a wide leg style. Um, two pockets right here. And here's the back. And um, I got mine in like a 10 pound um, canvas. And... Um, it doesn't have a seam on this side, only in the inner, um, I don't know, inner thigh, I guess, inner leg. And it's it's exactly the same as the sailor pants. And I do plan on making more in the future. I just haven't had the time to like really sit down and, and start on the project. So yeah, this is the Anna Allen Persephone pants. And the last one in my collection is this Aritzia Babaton pants. Um, I actually dyed this to be this color when I bought it. It was um, kind of like a taupey pink and I, I don't know, it was a really weird color and so I, just, I decided it was it wasn't for me um, so I dyed this to be kind of more in a um, clay color um, but yeah high-waisted has like pockets here I love that it's um, it's a super thin material it's cotton um, I think it's cotton cotton or twill um, but again it's kind of like a straight more on the wide leg Actually, it's like a straight leg, but more on the wider side. Um, I love this style. It has also back pockets that I, I love. And yeah, these are the Aritzia Babaton high-waisted pants.